Hey, what's up, everybody? RJ back with another video. And a very interesting article came out uh, in next month's Muscle and Fitness magazine with Vince McMahon, um, which uh, when you click on this video, you will see the Muscle and Fitness picture right when you click on it, so you know what I'm talking about. Uh, Vince is pretty ripped for a 69-year-old. I mean, hope I look that way, you know, or close to it when I'm 69. If I hit the gym hard enough, maybe. <laughs> Probably not. But he is uh, hes in great shape. Uh, they talk in the article about, you know, what he thinks the WWE will be like once he passes. And he said that he thinks it'll be, in a lot of ways, better um, than it is now with... Uh, the executives that they got and stuff, but they, he goes on to say that there's no one, there's no one that can replace him in the company. No one knows as much as he does about the business and this, that, and the other, which in a lot of ways is probably true considering how long he's been, you know, in charge. But at the same time, uh, you can be in tar charge of something for years and still be out of touch, which some people will say he is. And in certain situations, I mean, he is, but uh, he goes on to talk about who his favorite character is, and he says that his favorite character was always the Undertaker for more than one reason. One, he never break. Apparently, he never breaks character. Undertaker never breaks character, no matter how much they try to get him to at times. And he thinks that's fantastic, which does sound funny. I like to see them trying to do that. That'd be pretty cool. And uh, another thing is that he works through his injuries. Vince is big on you know accountability and wanting people to work as much as they can i think hence why john cena is probably always on top because that guy always works through you know i mean they, he could be gone for like three weeks and supposed to be gone six months and we come back early and stuff and vince is big on on that kind of stuff and he goes on to talk about you know how undertaker works through injuries and things like that and uh yeah, I just thought it was fascinating what he thought about the WWE, what will happen to it once he's gone. He says that, you know, Stephanie and Triple H will be a big part of it, which there's no doubt. And that it will be, in a lot of ways, better than it is now. So saying that it will be better than it is now, but at the same time saying no one can replace him, it's a little odd. It's a little odd, but check out the full article. I'll put it in the description box. Check it out, and if you guys could, give this video a thumbs up. I'll see you guys later.